from your weather authority, meteorologist Stacy May. Well, beautiful weather continues for us today, but not just for today, really for the rest of the work week. We knew we had a nice stretch coming our way, a much needed one after all of the severe weather uh, that we had last week and into the weekend. But again, starting on Memorial Day, things got a lot calmer and they continue to be that way. So let's look at our first morning focus. Again, beautiful weather keeps on going. Past couple of days, highs were in the lower 80s. Now today is actually going to be a little bit cooler and so is tomorrow and Friday. High of about 75 today and then in the upper 70s to close to 80. It looks like for your Thursday and Friday, it's going to stay dry. And more importantly than the uh, cooler temperatures, we're just going to keep that humidity low. And even if we were in the 80s uh, with low humidity, it would feel great outside. Now the changes start this weekend. Scattered showers and thunder showers will return on Saturday and right now that is still looking like our highest chance of rain. It is going to gradually get warmer too and more humid later in the weekend and into the early part of next week. Now nothing crazy uh, with the heat or the humidity and I really think the humidity will stay tolerable and just kind of flirt with some humid air. But compared to the pleasant air that we have out there right now, we will notice more humidity, uh, especially next week. Now live Doppler radar is nice and quiet and it will continue to stay that way. Like I said, at this point, it still looks like it'll be sometime on Saturday. So here's our Maldonado's tower cam from Ellis Park, looking at the twin bridges there between Evansville and Henderson at a partly cloudy sky and traffic moving fine. West side of Evansville, our Austin Homes tower camera out there on the USI campus, some sunshine uh, beaming down on it. And then the east side of Evansville, looking from Deaconess Gateway Hospital, this is our Diamond Valley Federal Credit Union Tower camera there. Again, partly cloudy sky, and there's a really good view of just those puffy cumulus clouds that have kind of developed here around the midday hour. And we'll stay with us through this afternoon and then kind of fade away as we head toward and through sunset this evening. So the temperature right now, a very pleasant 72 degrees and notice the dew point. Uh, we get kind of excited uh, once we get closer and closer to June and especially into our summer months when the dew point is in the 50s and it is closer to that uh, 50 degree mark. We're going to start to get more and more humid days around here. So we'll take as many days with the dew point in the low 50s uh, that we can get. And it's coming in that drier, cooler air because of a north wind at 12 miles per hour. So a little bit breezy, uh, but it's shouldn't get much stronger than that this afternoon. Uh, and again, the temperature won't go up all that much more either. So here's where we sit right now. Most of us have at least reached 70. Few of you are a little shy of that. Vincennes down to Jasper, it's 68. And over in Santa Claus, it's 69. The rest of us at 70 or above. And the warmest spots are down here for those of you in Madisonville, 73. And down in Greenville, uh, you're at 73 also. So very quiet here on Storm Tracker. Not much happening uh, around our region. Again, few of those clouds are bubbling up. But any rain is to our northeast and down to our southwest. And none of that is coming our way for a few more days. So here's an updated future tracker, which keeps us partly cloudy this afternoon. Those clouds diminish for us this evening. Skies go mainly clear for the overnight hours. We do this again tomorrow. Plenty of sunshine to start the day. Some clouds bubble up and mix in in the afternoon, but we stay dry. Those fade away again tomorrow night, and we repeat it one more time on Friday. Plenty of sunshine to start the day, and then just kind of a partly cloudy sky through our Friday afternoon. But later Friday night and then into our Saturday, that's when at least some scattered showers and thunder showers will be returning. So here's your forecast for today. Partly cloudy and pleasant, a little bit of a breeze out there and highs a little bit cooler in the mid 70s then tomorrow mainly clear and cooler will drop down into the mid 50s so that's going to be cooler than what we started off with this morning tomorrow looks great too lots of sunshine 78 and then lots of sunshine on Friday a little breezier on Friday and Saturday with those highs in the upper 70s and that's when that next system comes on in. And again, we'll have scattered showers and thunder showers, especially on Saturday. That's our highest chance of rain right now. And then we'll begin to bring down that rain chance some on Sunday. Can't completely take it off the board though. So we'll keep about a 30% chance going for a few scattered showers and thunder showers for the end of the weekend and then into the early part of next week. And also notice those temperatures. Like I said, it is going to be warming back up. Highs are going to be in the middle 80s by next Monday and Tuesday. And it is going to feel a little more humid, but 
Nothing crazy yet, Gretchen, uh, with okay. the heat and humidity, just feeling a little more summer-like. Gotcha. But yeah. today's fabulous. It's it just perfect. feels so great it out. It feels amazing. It does. Our pet of the day is next from the Straight. War Humane Society.